Based on the described situation, if this occurred in Reseda, California, the act could potentially be classified as sexual battery under California law. According to California Penal Code Section 243.4, sexual battery is defined as touching an intimate part of another person against their will for the purpose of sexual arousal, sexual gratification, or sexual abuse. This includes touching that is done directly or through the clothing of the victim. The law considers the anus as an intimate part, and therefore the act of inserting fingers into someone's rectum without consent could be seen as sexual battery. The law stipulates that such acts, when committed against the will of the person and for the specified purposes, can be subject to legal action and penalties. In California, the intent behind an act like the one you described can significantly influence how it's classified and prosecuted. The law states that sexual battery involves touching another person's intimate parts against their will for purposes of sexual arousal, gratification, or abuse. Importantly, the law also includes situations where the intent is to injure, hurt, humiliate, intimidate, or cause pain in someone's intimate parts. Therefore, even if the motivation wasn't sexual pleasure but to anger or humiliate Perry Caravello, it could still potentially be considered sexual battery under California law.